Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2021 Corvette C8 convertible 2LT with front lift. This one is painted in torch red with the adrenaline red interior. We'll start at the rear here. We got the rear trunk open, looking nice and tidy here. Uh, in, inside the trunk, we got the cargo net here and we have the upgraded Corvette racing all weather floor liner. So that's a nice touch. Uh, nice storage capacity in here. You can put lots of shopping items, uh, golf bags, uh, whatever you please. We'll go ahead and close that trunk. It's got the soft close. And we'll zoom out here so you can see the top is down. And there's your interior. You can see the red interior. Uh, the convertible top is down, like I said. It has the uh, carbon flash painted nacelles there as well as the full roof. And then right behind that is where the engine is located. So it's a mid-engine car. It's a 6.2 liter V8 producing 495 horsepower. This one is paired to an eight speed dual clutch automatic transmission as all C8s are. We'll walk back here. You can see the Stingray badge there. It's painted carbon flash. And then we have the high wing installed on this one. So that, that is done in carbon flash as well. And then down below we have the uh, exhaust. Uh, so it's got the NPP performance exhaust that allows you to change the exhaust note from loud to quiet or vice versa. And you can do that while you're driving the car. So really neat feature. Okay, making our way to the wheels. We have the five open spoke design wheel and they're painted uh, black. Uh, Michelin tires all the way around the car. Uh, rear size is a 305 30ZR20. Uh, we have the uh, four wheel disc brakes, as you can see, and the calipers are done in the edge red. All right, make our way to the front wheel now. As you can see, the front wheels are the matching pair. We have Michelin tires on the front as well. Uh, tire size for the front is a, a 245 35ZR19. And those re edge red calipers do say Corvette on them as well. Okay, let's make our way to the interior now. So we got a combination of black and adrenaline red. So mostly black door panel. You're gonna see that nice red stitch here. It's done in a baseball stitch. The armrest is done in adrenaline red. We have the Bose Performance Series sound system, the memory package for the passenger, power windows, power locks, and electronic door release. Dash on this side here, it's all black. A little bit of red trim there. And then we've got the red stitching here. We'll open the glove compartment. You can see it's got the owner's manual in there. I'll show you the jams, they're nice and tidy. Kick plate looks good, that says Stingray. Nice and clean there. And then down below we have the Corvette Racing all weather floor mats. So you can see the Jake uh, skull there. Nice touch. And then we have the eight way power seats. So you've got power bolster and lumbar as well. And let's scan the seat here. So they're adrenaline red. So nice bright red seat. And these are the GT1 seats. In between the seats, we've got the speaker grill here. And then down below, we have the wireless charging station for your cell phone. And we'll uh, close this door here. Show you that profile, that rear spoiler, high wing done in carbon flash and then we'll walk down here you can see the carbon flash let's zoom in here you can see the sparkle on the carbon flash and the whole roof is done in carbon flash as well there's your red seats against the red paint and you can see the carbon flash side mirrors as well as the vent down here and then we have the full side skirt on here and you can see the stingray R uh, badge there right on the full skirt there looking great and on the front matching that side skirt, we have the front spoiler. You can see it's the same design with that lip up there. Uh, allows, you, allows the air to go right through. Gives it a real exotic look to the car. Okay, making our way to the front now. We have uh, front cameras on both sides. And I'll come down here and I'm gonna feel that front spoiler. And I can tell you that feels like brand new, so I don't feel any scrapes. And then uh, underneath the front trunk here, nice and clean. And then here's your storage capacity here. Again, that matching uh, 
all-weather floor liner there in the uh, front trunk. We got the uh, cargo divider here. Uh, 12 volt socket right here. So that'd be where you would charge your, your battery with your trickle charger, engine coolant add, and windshield wiper add there. Go ahead and close this hood now. And you can see in the front here, we have the Corvette Racing hood decal. And you can see that really cool Jake skull there. And if you look here, it's got all these little Corvette uh, flags in there. So really cool design. And we'll come into the paint here. You can see how beautiful this torch red paint is. Just extra, extra shiny. And this car has just been finished by your team. So it's got the five stage polish on it, which is why it looks so great. And I can tell you the video doesn't do it justice. It looks better when in person and even better outside. Here's your front wheel there, looking sharp. And then your rear wheel. And then coming to your door panel. So mostly black door panel, that red stitching, the red armrest, the Bose Performance Series sound system, the memory packs for the driver, power mirrors, power folding mirrors. I'll hit that button here so you can see it function. Back out again, blind spot monitoring, power windows, uh, your power convertible hard top, and then your rear window. Uh, we have power locks here, electronic door release, and front and rear trunk. And dash on this side here. That slot is for your heads up display. It does have heads up. And then here's your jams on this side, looking great. Kick plate looking good, nice and clean. Pedals down there. Your nice floor liners, eight way power seats, power bolster and lumbar, and scan the uh, GT1 adrenaline seat here. Great design. There's the Corvette flags and the headrest there. And I think it's time to jump in the car. Okay. Close that door here. So over here, we got the uh, vent system here. So the HVAC system, uh, really sleek design. You can't hardly tell it's a vent. Uh, over here, we got heads up display controls. Down below, we have your dash dimming lights here and then your electronic parking brake. Over here on the steering column, we got power tilt and telescopic steering wheel. Headlight controls here. We got paddle shifters on both sides, so up shift, down shift. Your Z uh, button takes you to your performance pages. Uh, we got cruise settings here and then audio controls on both sides. Heated steering wheel, Bluetooth voice command, arrow keys for your digital dash and then your windshield wipers here. It's a push button start, so right here we'll fire it up. And we'll zoom back out here so you can see that wheel, uh, a black leather wheel. We got the nice red center point here, flat top, flat bottom, red stitching throughout, and we got the nice bump outs here. Uh, right in the center, we got the Corvette flags there, and then coming into the uh, dash, we got a full digital cluster. Uh, mileage on this car, you can see the bottom left hand corner, 9,124 kilometers. So a low kilometer 21. Coming up here, we have the universal garage door opener built on the visor. And if you can see up here, we got uh, an eyebrow on the windshield here, giving it that uh, aggressive look, look, as well as tinted windows. We'll see that up in a bit. We got the light sensor review mirror here and it's also a rear camera mirror when the top is up uh, and then we let's start here and then we have an eight inch touch screen here so uh, you got your icons here so we got factory nav there's your nav there go back home uh, we have apple carplay android auto performance data recorder we got climate controls here uh, here's your front camera there so there's your front of your car you can see that spoiler there and your side angles Come back to home and I'll throw it in reverse. So you can see it's got reverse camera and you can see how crisp the camera uh, is on this as well. Put it back in park here now. Coming down here is your automatic transmission controls. So it's a push pull design and allows you to use those paddle shifters. And then coming up here, we have your traction control. And then here we got a really cool uh, front lift button. So that has memory as well. So that'll raise your axle about two inches. Uh, when you're approaching something that it's a little steeper, you don't want to scrape, so you hit that button there. Um, and then we have front camera here, it's a quick way to get to it. And then we have your mode selector here, so it's a dial underneath. 
Uh, come back into the dash. I'll turn it all the way to the beginning now. So weather mode is the first one. I'll turn it again, my mode, so you can customize it. Tour mode, and you can see it changes all the metrics every time you change the dial. And sport and track. Sport and track open the exhaust valves up so it's louder. And then it also changing the steering, engine shift feel, brake feel, and engine sound every time I turn that dial. Okay, coming back to the uh, console here, we got the tower, I like to call it the uh, climate tower. So we got dual zone climate control, and then we have heated and ventilated seats for driver and passenger. Uh, here we got a nice adrenaline red console cover here, two cup holders right here. And then into the console, we got a black cover with the red stitching here. Open that up, put my hand in here so you can see how deep it is. And then you can see it has USB and auxiliary here. All right, let's uh, open the door now. I'll turn on the headlights and it's rev time. One, two, three. That sounds wonderful. All right, let's hop out of the car now. Let's get this top up. So this button here. And I'll show you how this functions. And you can do this while you're driving as well. You can see it's underneath the tunnel cover. It's all painted nicely. And here's your carbon flash roof. And all I'm doing is holding this button and it does all the work for me. There we are here. The rear window and the side windows come up. And we'll see that dark window tint now. And make our way to the front here. You can see the headlights on now. And just a great look. All this, the spoilers and skirts. You know, the wing really makes this car look exotic. And it's super shiny, being five stage polished by our team. You can see the profile of that wing on this side here. Here's your LED tail lights. And listen to that exhaust. Alright, so here we have it. This is a 2021 Corvette C8 convertible 2LT with front lift, high wing and skirt package. This is uh, painted in torch red with the adrenaline red interior. This is here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come down and have a look at this one for yourself. We look forward to seeing you real soon.